Hello everybody, welcome back to Patfoot TD Games. My name is Zach, I'm the voice behind the icon, and today we are back once again at Modified Racing here at Monadnock Speedway. This is the NASCAR Weekly Series here at Monadnock Speedway in Winchester, New Hampshire. We have 16 cars that'll be starting the events this year and total 27 trying to race their way in. Difficulty set at 93% for the AI and really excited about it. These events are 50 laps except for special events that are 100. Along with today's event here, there is Mini Stock, Thunder Stock, Pro Stock, and of course the Husky Tools Modified Racing Series for the Kona Ice 100 that will be at the conclusion of the night. That's our headliner. And those all can be seen on Patfoot TD Games. And if you want to see it in TV style, all those races can be seen on Padfoot TD Live, our brand new channel. Really excited to be out here with these guys. You're going to see we have a new sponsor on the car. We'll talk to you about that a little bit in practice. Let's get out there. Let's get a couple laps in. And let's have a good time here at Midnight Knox Speed. All right, coming out at turn four here. Coming up to the front stretch. Feeling pretty good in our car this year. We've done a lot of work in the garage since we were not able to do a test session because of the virus before Mananoc had opened up for the year. These dates are correlation, are connected, I should say, to the actual events of Mananoc Speedway to give you guys a little bit of racing before we can actually hit that pavement once again. On board, as you can see in the rear view mirror and you'll see in the replays, is One Stop Country Pet Supply Store. Of, of their main chain in Keene, New Hampshire. They have a chain in Brattleboro and Barrie, Vermont as well. Really excited to have a local sponsor on the car. Uh, IK9 does a lot for us, but One Stop has always been there for our, our own dogs as well. So really happy to have them on the car. Trying to get a little bit comfortable here at the practice. Just trying to show you guys a little bit of what we are looking for. And we got turned in practice. Are you kidding me? Yeah, of course, we're in the preferred line and there's no cautions. I got no spotter, so we just sit tight, pull it into the grass, and I think we can call it there. As you can tell, the AI is much faster than me. All right, we'll see you guys at qualifying. All right, coming out in our cream-colored Ford Mustang. We're going to come out here very quick away around this track. Quarter mile, not quarter mile, eighth of a mile. As we head in, I could not get the car where I wanted it to go. It would not stick for me one bit so we're gonna have to do a little bit of work in happy hour before the main event no idea where we've placed yet we usually like to keep that as a surprise to you guys one lap down and we felt like we did pretty good on lap number two not the speed that i want i'm hoping to get a little bit more speed off of two and we could have probably gotten a little bit more speed in three but that's our qualifying run we're gonna see you guys out on the grid for the weekly racing series here at midnight knock speedway drivers Start your engines! All right, we're actually going to be starting in last. Times were very close to each other, and we need to get a little bit more practice back here at Monadnock before we can really get ourselves going. There was no testing beforehand. There was no test in tune because of this virus. So, bummer on that one, <clears throat> but we've got a long year. Let's keep our car together. I forget Big everybody slams in. on the brake before we get into turn three. Green flag, green flag. And green, green is out for 50 green. laps here at Monadnock. I can't control my car at all, it seems. This is going to be a rough one. But let's see how we can get ourselves on the inside. Okay, we've lost a gear. We've lost fourth gear already. We are plagued from the start here. Car's loose. We don't have fourth gear. They're going three wide in front of us, which is never a good sign. Stay low. Still there. Oh, they're crashing. They're crashing. They're crashing. There's somebody coming up. There's somebody coming Still up. There. Watch them. Watch them. Watch them. Watch them. Keep low. Okay. I'm bummed that we're already going to get a new transmission. Yeah, I always check out what's going on with fourth gear. Now Feels good nine. to be back with these guys and ladies as well. Nothing like hometown racing. Clear outside. Keep low. Still there. Feeling pretty good on that inside line if you can cap it, but of course we're not getting as much speed Clear. as we need to. On either of the stretches, we're gonna be pushing our car 
really hard just in third gear. But it's the cards that we've been dealt. We're making that inside line work for us, but man, we are still very loose. So we're getting we're getting we're taking notes. <laughs> first first off of the year. Lots of notes to be had. Really excited to be back though. I'm gonna keep saying that just because I am. I, I love racing at Manadnock. It's my my home. I've always wanted to own a modified, but I've got horses and all kinds of other stuff that we do. So Modified racing will not fit into our schedule. Plus, I still like being a, a fan. Sorry, commentary is going to be sparse here and there because I still want to make sure we do good. We've got a, definitely a packed night here for all the fans. Really excited too. We're gonna to be in the sports trucks here at Manadnock. Um, the sprints are gonna come and race here. We've got uh, antique stocks that are gonna be here. There's gonna be an enduro events that we might take part in. Just super excited about it all. If I can stay not loose in turn two. Let's try and make all that ground back up. Now, practice for the Husky Modified Tool Racing Series, Husky Tool Modified Racing Series, uh, felt much smoother than this. This car still needs a lot of work, so it looks like we'll be coming to a Wednesday test in tune just to get that settled out. But of course, a lot of our races are at night. This one's at, during the day because to accommodate for the other modifieds at night. The track is definitely a little bit different. I don't even know what position we're in. Not first. That's that's what I know. We made our way up a little bit, but I don't think even into the top ten. I'm creeping up there, but I don't feel like I'm making any gain like I was before. The temp is going higher and higher. I see that oil temp over there. That 81's got a lot of speed. Where we lose them is on the stretch. We just can't get up to a fast enough speed. Way to start the season. <laughs> Man, the guy's coming down on me hard. In the space, we still got time. Of course, with that little battle caused everybody behind us to catch up. Felt like we had a pretty good divide from them. Oh, we're only halfway? Jeez. I will say at least our tires get a little bit more uh, traction. A lot more rubber has been laid down on the track. So that's been nice. Well, except turn one. Turn one has nothing. Turn three and four I like.
really worried about that oil tank. No light on yet. But it's not going to get any better. <laughs> We're as fresh air as we possibly can have. Definitely need some practice here. And overall, the car's doing fine, you know. Going from last and we're still crawling our way up. Slowly, but we are. Gotta work on the brake bias as well. And the pressure of the pedal. found out, by the way, when we were using uh, our pedal last year, I didn't know that we had broken our throttle pedal. The uh, tension spring inside had broken. So we were driving pretty much no or all gas last year. So that was fun. I stopped drive, dragging that left front. Tires are expensive. Drive trying to catch the 81. I'll catch him if you go. Wheel hop there in two. That's new. We're holding together strong. We're surprised we've gone green this long. We had that incident that almost happened in the beginning, but we've all spread out pretty well since then. Which is, yet again, I will say this, and I always say it. As a fan, I hate to see these kind of races. They're not interesting to me. We obviously, we've got one car. We've got a couple cars that are making their way through the pack. That's fun to watch. I, I like a little bit of incidents. I like to jump them back up. But as a competitor, let's we'll stay green. More to go. So I get it. I get why they want to stay green. I get why caution's frustrating. We'll use the chrome horn. I will get you out of there. Finally was faster than him. I think I'm going to use up everything before I can actually get him. Wheel hop still in one. Boy. that bumper, but then he just pulls away. I have to try to make something work in turn four. Jump two to go. Time's now. Give him a little nudge. I don't think it's going to be enough. Red flag's out. One more lap to go. Force him up the hill. I don't think he's going to do anything. Nah, he's going to. He's got it. Darn! <laughs> good race, though. Good race, everybody all around. We'll take a top ten. I know there's only 16 of us, but... 
Whew, that extra little difficulty is hard, and especially through the day itself. We'll take a ninth, though. It's better than how we started last year. The race year. is over. Come on in. Keep it under 50. Right. We are sitting ninth, obviously, in the standings. One out of 13 events that are going to be happening this summer. Really excited about it. This next upcoming week, there is going to be a 100 lapper, which <laughs> 50 laps and an SK modified. The speed is way different. It feels way different than the two worrying mods. Um, but man, we've got, a, we've got a lot of work to do. You know, um, good job to Abel Jr. up there. But jeez, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm just surprised on that whole entire outcome. <laughs> but I'm glad. This is giving us a challenge, and I think that's what we really need. Abel Jr. actually led every single lap. Hopefully we can change that next week. I think we head into a nighttime race, maybe. Um, but we'll see. It's a lot of fun. Don't forget to check out Padfoot TD Live if you want to see this in TV style, including mini stocks, pro stocks, street stocks, as well as this division. And you can check out the Husky Tools Modified Racing Series on that channel as well. All in TV style, so you don't have to listen to my voice. Just enjoy the racing. But with that, that's going to do it for this one, guys. If you enjoy what you saw, we do have that new channel, Padfoot TD Live. Link's down there in the description below. So is in our Instagram if you want to follow us around with all of our dogs and our horses and all the adventures we are going to be taking this year. As well, a thumbs up is always appreciated if you enjoy the video and a subscribe just lets us know we're doing something right and it does put a smile on our face every day when we get to see that number. But with that, I thank you guys so much for coming out to this one and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>